God never said that the journey would be easy, but he did say that the arrival would be worthwhile. Remember who you are. Don't compromise for anyone, for any reason. You are a child of the Almighty God. Live that truth. If God is your partner, make your plans big, one encounter with Jesus Christ is enough to change you, instantly, forever. The name of Jesus is the one lever that lifts the world. The greatest thing a man can do for his heavenly father is to be kind to some of his other children. Do not be anxious about tomorrow, for tomorrow will be anxious for itself. Let the day's own trouble be sufficient for the day, when we speak of faith, the faith that can move mountains. We are not speaking of faith in general, but of faith in the Lord Jesus Christ. If we all lived according to the teachings of Jesus Christ, life would be much simpler. What you are is God's gift to you, what you become is your gift to God. The Bible tells us that Jesus Christ came to do three things. He came to have my past forgiven, you get a purpose for living and a home in heaven. I've read the last page of the Bible. It's all going to turn out all right. God has a purpose behind every problem. He uses circumstances to develop our character. In fact, he depends more on circumstances to make us like Jesus than he depends on our reading the Bible. And when the Lord Jesus has become your peace, remember, there is another thing. Goodwill towards men. Do not try to keep Christmas without goodwill towards men. When we lose one blessing, another is often most unexpectedly given in its place. Don't pray when you feel like it. Have an appointment with the Lord and keep it. A man is powerful on his knees. God does not give us everything we want, but he does fulfill his promises, leading us along the best and straightest paths to himself. God didn't give you the strength to get back on your feet so that you can run back to the same thing that knocked you down, let the one among you who is without sin be the first to cast a stone. We must show our Christian colors if we are to be true to Jesus Christ. I fell in love with Jesus because he loved me when I couldn't even love myself. I don't believe in luck or magic. I believe in Jesus and blessing. There is only one love that loves unconditionally, the love of divine. For those who love, nothing is too difficult. Especially when it is done for the love of our Lord Jesus Christ. I love Jesus because in our crazy messy world, he is my peace. At the cross, I bow my knee, where your blood was shed for me, there's no greater love than this. His love never fails, his forgiveness never ends. So my hope never stops, and my life will never be the same. Jesus, I thank you that nothing in this world can separate me from your love. I might lose battles, but I will not lose my faith and the will to keep going with my God. Rejection is an opportunity for your selection. The irony is that while God doesn't need us, but still wants us, we desperately need God, but don't really want Him most of the time. Just keep asking yourself, what would Jesus not do? Anything under God's control is never out of control. Spending time with God is the key to our strength 
and success in all areas of life. Be sure that you never try to work God into your schedule, but always work your schedule around Him. Jesus promised His disciples three things, that they would be completely fearless, absurdly happy, and in constant trouble. Good works is giving to the poor and the helpless. But divine works is showing them their worth to the one who matters.